Are you back for the night, sir? Shall I warm up Christmas dinner? No. It's going to be a long night, Alfred. I just ran into a human-shaped crocodile who told me Black Mask has hired assassins to kill me. Assassins, sir. As in more than one. That's right. And you heard this from the mouth of a crocodile, man. His name is Killer Croc. He's already behind bars. Oh, I pity his cellmate. I don't. Let's see what else is on the drone's hard drive. Each of them gets one of these envelopes. I need them delivered tonight. They're all hired killers. The best in the business. Black Mask isn't messing around. Slade Wilson, Deathstroke. Former military, subject of a failed medical experiment. Failed, you say? Garfield Lins, a.k.a. Firefly, burns on 90% of his body. His obsession is going to be his end. How unlike anyone I know. Here's a face I don't recognize. Copperhead. Strange. These reports reference a male, not a female. Fourteen escapes, huh? Well, you won't be getting out of them. What the... Floyd Lawton, a.k.a. Deadshot, Freeze. says here he's an expert sharpshooter. How on earth? Suspected of many assassinations. Dangerous, but reckless. Street tough named Lester Baczynski. Calls himself Electrocutioner. Shocking. Shiva. Her skill is unmatched. Is that Warden Joseph? Must be how Black Mask got inside the prison. He uses torture for intimidation and entertainment. Eight assassins after your head. What are you going to do? I'm going to find out who is operating this drone. Make them tell me what they know. Then I'm going to find Black Mask and put an end to this. Sir, I may be stating the obvious here, but you do realize that since you and I are the only people who know the Batman's true identity, those assassins will all fail their mandate if you'd just spend the evening here. They'll put innocence in danger to attract my attention. I can't take that risk. And you think it's a better idea to just put yourself in their crosshairs? There's only one person in Gotham who can get his hands on something like this. The Penguin. He's been tracking Black Mask. Its next waypoint was a rendezvous with Penguin's men at Jezebel Plaza. 
I'll make them talk. You're sure this is wise, sir? I know what I'm doing. Well, in case you change your mind and want to train tonight instead, I'll keep your training facility active. The Batwing is prepped and ready to take you to Jezebel Plaza. So, to make your travels easier, I went ahead and set up some auto-nav points at different areas of the city. One of my preset destinations should take you right to Jezebel Plaza. my smoke pellets here. Come on. I need to get up and out of danger. He can't going? shoot what he can't okay. see. I'm watching you from over here. Attacking head-on is a good way to get myself shot, and probably the hostage, too. But they won't expect an attack from above. Nobody ever does. Is that thing out there with you? Are you crazy? We were answering the service call, that's it? You better not be lying. Who's out there? Some off or something? No way. Either way, we need to get the hell out of here. Now! I'm gonna wait here, you guys!
get yourself to safety and call the police. They'll want to see what's going on here. Okay, I will. This was just supposed to be a service call. Where are you I can fix the tower. Whatever you want. Just please don't hurt me. All I want is for you to get yourself to safety. malfunction is from storm damage. I need to set up a crime scene and find out what happened. I should start by identifying the victim. Victim's name is David Shannon, a Gotham Optics employee sent here to repair a faulty network tower. But what killed him? Scanning the DNA impact on the wall should provide an answer. analysis indicates the victim was killed by some kind of explosion originating at that access panel. I should scan it for additional clues. I should investigate this crime scene before going any further. was rigged to detonate when swiped with a key card. Someone really didn't want this tower repaired, and it looks like that same someone left a set of fingerprints behind. Alfred, I'm uploading some prints for analysis. Let me know what comes back. Certainly, sir. Searching now. And here we are. They belong to one John F. Baker. He's a rather unremarkable criminal. Small jobs, mostly. And they... Hmm. That's curious. What's curious? Mr. Baker's dead, sir. His body was recovered from the Diamond District just under an hour ago. Looks like someone's tying up loose ends. I can bypass the booby-trapped access panel with my cryptographic sequencer, but I'll need the encryption codes from the victim's access card. Reviewing the crime scene will show me where it is.
This card has the codes I need to hack any of the network tower's access panels. to freeway radio of the people for the people stands are legendary with extra large chunks of sugary fruit bits right there are your party crackers bland do your breakfast pancakes need an extra bit of sweet flavor do you like the taste of no. got reports of graffiti on the north side of the museum of antiquities we got nothing better to do give it us some words Violent actions being the last. You can go. We got injured. You can. The rest. We got nothing better to do. Give it to someone else. The flyers were left behind. They bore the title Plain Words. The box. Apparently moved by the holiday spirit, Gotham's favorite billionaire, Bruce Wayne, donated 10,000 pairs of shoes to the Homeless Foundation. <laughs> Wayne's generous words have been interpreted as both sentimental and ironic, as it is well known that the extravagant philanthropist... If it sounds familiar, that's because it is. Just replace communist or socialist or... ...the urban mythology surrounding the Batman. My point is that doesn't discredit his very real impact on God. You can find all the flavors of my home canned fruit preserves at your local supermarket. <laughs> Capitalist masters, we will never know true freedom. So, without further ado... <laughs> push over an old lady and kick her dog in the face, and walk right back over here into this studio... <laughs> We're in for a holiday treat this afternoon when they found piles of shoe boxes individually gift wrapped under their tree in the shelter lobby. Apparently, area units, we have an ocean to the homeless foundation saying, quote, everyone deserves a means to pull themselves. <laughs> Parents on my show, what's he scared of, huh? Your point, I really doubt. Area units, we have an 073 possible break in at the one millions and your usurped fame than to direct all the power of the area units. Try you don't the area try my product, KJ's fruit preserves. My jams are legendary with extra large chunks of sugary fruit bits. Right there in the jar. You can find all the flavors of my home canned fruit preserves at your local supermarket, right by the jelly. My point! Are your party crackers bland? Do your breakfast pancakes need... Alfred, contact the GCPD. Let them know about the body. Send the data from my analysis, too. Certainly, sir. Does this mean you found the source of the disturbance? I think so. Well, well, if it isn't the King's thug himself. I figured it was only a matter of time before you showed up. Sorry about the mess downstairs. Who is this? Think of me as a great big mystery. One you're never going to solve. Enigma, then. Oh, you must think you're so clever. Well, how's this for clever? I've taken control of towers all over the city. As long as they're active, your bat wing's useless. 
and it looks like it's going to stay that way. I mean, this one's practically begging to be taken offline, and you still can't hack it. Pun intended, of course. Hmm, Black Mask's not going to like this. What are you talking about? Wouldn't you like to know? With the jammer offline, I can travel here with the Batwing. Those relays are part of a distributed security system. I wonder what they're protecting. That must be where Enigma set up shop. I need to pay him a visit. I see you've regained control of the Batwing, sir. I suppose it's off to Jezebel Plaza, then. That's the plan. Then I've also got a lead on Enigma. Well, don't overthink it too much, sir. We both know you'll eventually wind up doing both. I'm running out of time. I should head for Jezebel Plaza. the GCPD dispatcher just mentioned. I could go investigate, perhaps stop the crime, but I also need to get to the arms dealer Jezebel Plaza. 